If you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a ball. What? Yo, yo, this is Not Your Average Gamer, folks, and uh, it's basically the end of the night. It is, well, it's only 6.30, but, you know, I'm, I've been playing the game all day today, just en trying to enjoy my Saturday, and um, I got some freaking crazy clips for you. So I'm going to go to my uh, my clips here, so you can see what I've been getting Saturday first Saturday of uh, 2016 I've been playing Rainbow Six like all day today I played a little Dishonored earlier but I got some freaking crazy clips like all of these clips you see them six hours ago seven hours ago all these clips were uh, today it should be more than this one too uh, this one wasn't even fully recorded there should be more of this so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna manage captures so I can make sure I'm not looking into just the captures that's on my Xbox. I want to make sure I don't have anything to upload. Q. Okay, see, I got a lot of stuff in here. All right, we're just gonna pick something. I got so many clips to show you. It's four screen there, boy. four is located above. Get ready to engage. I got the door. All right, so it looks kind of funny, but I'm actually talking to this gentleman here. He's in my party. You just can't hear it at that moment. And I was telling him to put up a castle wall there instead of a uh, shield and to put the shield a little behind it. So I got a nitro cell on this wall here. And this guy's going to walk up and I'm going to blow him away. Like I had some freaking awesome clips today. Whoa, that's bad. Oh, they didn't fall for it that time. Absolute massacre. Build your barricades back. Really important. If you have the time to build your barricades, build them back. So that's the end of that clip. Let's see. Here's another clip. I've been running posts all day today. And I never really played with posts like that, but I was running a good post. Alright, so I told Castle to build the barricade back up, and I was checking it was safe with the uh, post, the heartbeat sensor. He killed him, and he built the post back up the pulse he built the barricade back up sorry so I'm scanning I'm just scanning away this is what you want to do with pulse too you want to scan like crazy I found my next victim so I call castle over there in the party castle gets hit down I gotta go revive him really quick that's my guy Rue official you guys add him he's freaking awesome uh, if you ever want to add me my name is so easy music S O E K. What a headshot given to him. We came every side covered. I'm just going through my clip. So this clip was freaking awesome here. I was my Tanya and I had people behind me. I put the shield in. Put the shield in first. Just tried to scope out the room. Nobody was in there, but we got blinded. So I threw out smoke and then I laid out the diffuser. If you guys have my Tanya on your team, always run with uh, my Tanya as the uh, as the diffuser carrier it's best for him to do it now you can just stand back I told uh, Rue over there the guy who's running fuse to get behind me he actually ended up getting killed but he did get like one or two kills before it happened I think he got one yeah I think he killed Capcom over here nope he didn't he got killed okay he did he did he got some shots off, but he didn't get a kill. So, I don't know what made Capcom think I didn't just see her right there watching his back. And my teammate was flanking, too. That was ridiculous. Let's see what other clips we got here for you. Sorry, I didn't full screen the last one. Look at that. So, he runs. I build my barricade back up. Barricade every time you get the chance, people. That's extremely important in Rainbow Six. If you got a barricade, uh, if you got a second to barricade, when somebody's right there and they're being hesitant, barricade it. Put something in between them. I'd hate to be these people walking in right now, though. In three, two, one, time to die. Oh, oh, oh my gosh! I'd hate to be you. 
Now, I made a mistake and blew that C4 because I knew she was right there. But I saved my teammate because it was most important to save the teammate. I didn't know he was there to get hit too. Then we went out and my teammate actually saved my life as I was going out to flank her. That is why you always pick your teammates back up. People will get scared in that moment like the people I was in the lobby with and they'll say, no, don't save him. No, I need him because if I go down, who do I have to help me? And right now I have somebody to help me so I need to have him up. So that's what I did. I saved him. Here we go. Here's a great freaking clip. So I'm just chilling, spam spotting on the camera purposely to make him run, waste more time. It's only 18 seconds left. Here comes Montagne. There goes Montagne. He came, he saw, he did not conquer. And the other guy was nowhere to be found. Excellent defense. When you lay under that part of uh, this house over here, I forgot what the map is called, but when you lay right here, a lot of people will stay crouched instead of prone stay prone let people walk past you just sit there and chill if you notice if you look right here a little to the right of the aim site you'll see the armor barricade you can't see the ground so even if they were to break it they still cannot see you until they walk in that door so if you're gonna lay here lay down and just chill don't crouch you get killed like that this is actually what I went at the end of that match I don't know why my game just did that. Xbox has so many issues. Okay. So I went for 10, one assist, four kills, second place. I bought out. Okay. This time I have Castle. Last time I had a Bandit. I don't even. I don't know why he thought that was a smart idea. <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh, look at this. My first upside down kill with glass. The bank is the most awesome level to do this. Well, this is actually not the bank. It just looks like a bank. My teammate goes down. I see the guy run across. He should be running. There we go. These light posts were in my way. I was shooting the metal. Pulled off a good headshot, baby. Op 4 eliminated. Friendly mission successful. Let's see what we got here. I don't know what that guy was doing. He's a freaking weirdo. But anyway. So, I've been, I'm being spotted by this drone here. Now, what they want me to do is move around, expose myself, get close to a door or something so he can come shooting it. Which is why I came over here looking. Because usually when that happens, they go for some type of flank. But, it actually, to my surprise, worked out differently. Which is why I got this kill I'm about to get. Alright, it's two on four. Here comes a uh, double head shot for you. Exactly why I stayed away from that door. Uh, what you want to do when you're castle, if you notice I got the back window barricaded. And I had the other uh, door barricaded to my right like you can actually see it right here I had the back window barricaded the door to the left and the door in the middle so there was only one way in everywhere else we would obviously know they're coming and even with the other barricade you can hear them so that was the only door I really had to look at so I just knew they were there already uh, let's see I'm uh, running I'm running echo right now so these guys were actually outside this window right here what they were doing was waiting for me to come so they could kill me, but they were being hesitant because they didn't know where I was. So I barricaded. Like I said, barricade every time you get the chance. And I was actually able to get rid of the diffuser. How many times do you see a tactical win like that? Two on one, and I pulled it out. So my teammate made a mistake and killed somebody else on the team. And yes, it was a mistake. I was in the lobby with him. And she fused him. So the guy is actually to my right. He's hiding under there, which I figured, which is why I cracked that cracked that open to the right. And then I thermited this so I could look from both ends. And that actually works to my favor because sure enough, when I come back in, I see him hiding right where I knew he was. Couldn't shoot through the metal. Switched to the pistol. Boom. Ooh. Good night, Capcom.
And no, I don't teabag, so that's not what I was going to do. All right, here's a really, really, really good strategy with a uh, fuse. This is what you want to do. I'm sorry, fuse. A really good strategy with pulse. You want to get castle. You want to have somebody on your team as castle. If not castle, then you know, then just still throw the the nitro cell onto the wall anyway, to like a window wall to be exact, or just a point of interest where you know people will most likely try to come through. I saw him coming up. I backed up. Boom. And then I had Castle build the barricade back up. Build barricades back up as soon as you get the chance. I'm scanning again. I'm scanning again. Oh, oh, what's that? What's that? Okay, let's try this one more time. Goodness. Really good thing to do with post. Throw nitro cells on the door and scan them. People will always come to the door if you pick the right door. So as you can see, I've been running posts quite a bit today. It has some freaking awesome games we'll post today. Having some trouble scanning this time because they decided to take a different approach than what I expected. All right, I'm fine with that. I'm gonna call out a waypoint, left D-pad. Get into the habit of calling out that left D-pad waypoint so your team can have your back. Because that little distraction that the guy to the left of me just gave, gave me the opportunity to do what you're about to see me do now. Barricade it back. Remember, when you get the opportunity, barricade back. I know y'all hear me, I know, you, I know you guys hear me saying that a lot, and it's probably annoying, but it's true, and you need to hear it. That way it gets into your subconscious and you make it a habit. Barricade like crazy. And left D-pad and call out waypoints. By the way, drop shotting works awesome on this game. I know people used to do that on Morning Call of Duty. Get into the habit of that, because this is a one-life type of game. Most people either crouch or stand up. So I actually didn't kill him, which kind of made me mad. But I called like Steady over. I don't even remember what happened here. I think like Steady killed him. Yep, there's like Steady. No, I got him. Yep, I got him. One shot. He only had one shot left, so I remember this. I don't know how Lex Steady didn't kill him when he clearly took every little bit of health he had because it only took me one shot. But whatever. Kill him, barricade it back. Protect yourself. Your defense, build your defenses back up. Don't get so caught up in the battle that you just leave yourself open just because you got a kill and now you're on your toes oh somebody might come from here build it back usually when you kill somebody you have a second afterward to build a barricade because now people are skeptical wondering what's to come I think that's the end of that clip oh no that's not the end of that clip let's see oh yeah post baby post had a freaking awesome game that round this has been Not Your Average Gamer. See you guys next time. Thank you.